nature is magical. Like I never got why people didn't like think that the things that were free were the most valuable. Like when I was a kid, I would see you'd get toys and all this stuff. And then I'd go out in the creek in Crofton, Maryland, where I lived as a little kid. And I'd see like a newt, like a salamander, you know, like a little spotted salamander. And I'd be like, oh my God, like that thing is just walking around. You know what I mean? Like that thing is just coming out of the earth and living here. Like, and nobody puts a value on that, you know, but you, you put a value on a little matchbox car that somebody gives you as a gift. And you're like, oh, it's cool. I got a toy. You're living in a world that, that that's amazing. That's a miracle. People should look at butterflies and be like, oh my God, how does this exist? This is the coolest thing ever. And they're fast. And if you watch two butterflies play with each other, which I have tons of them, you know, and they circle each other and just fly through the air, it's mesmerizing, yeah. right? Clouds are mesmerizing. Sunsets, you know, like I saw a beautiful sunset last night. I don't understand why sunsets aren't church. You know, right. like the whole world should be like, hey, y'all, the sunset's happening now. Let's stop what we're doing and check out this sunset because mm -hmm. it's a gift. It's glorious. And it shows you how much bigger everything is.